Dr. Haddad said the surgery was very successful. She was able to remove all the bullet fragments. Oh, good. So Valentin's gonna be all right? We have reason to be optimistic. He's astonishingly resilient. You know, he's gonna make it. Can I go in and see him? Sure, sure. Um, as you know, you and Brooklyn have been given familial privileges. Mm -hmm. Just encourage him to get some rest. Okay, I'll try. Not promising. Mm -hmm. Did you miss me? Was I sleeping? Just a little nap? It was rude of me, I apologize. No. You need your rest in order to recover. Doctors say the surgery was very successful. Well, of course it was, darling. You didn't think I'd die in the operating table. That's not really my style. I just spoke with Brooklyn. Gave her an update. She sends her love. Said she's gonna bring Charlotte over tomorrow. That's very kind of her. Charlotte's the only medicine I'll need. But you do need actual medicine. The doctors are recommending a recovery protocol for you. No bouncy castle? <laughs> Not yet, no. What about Peter? Has he resurfaced? Has Victor been of any use at all? Victor wants to make a deal. So where is the WSB keeping this man now claiming to be my father? Steinmauer and the Hague? No, they're keeping him here, Port Charles. They want him to be close to me so I can have access during my investigation. Well, that's convenient. Have you spoken to him? No, I've been a bit busy. Sitting vigil at a friend's bedside. Your friend's a very lucky man. Can I ask you a question? How do you feel about Victor's claim that he's your father? I don't know. I mean, I wouldn't put it past Elena. It does sound like something she'd do, have an affair with her husband's brother, but I'm gonna need more than Victor's word. So you're not dismissing it out of hand? I don't think it matters, one way or the other. It's just a little unsettling, thinking that if he's telling the truth, that makes Charlotte and Bailey his granddaughters. Mm -hmm.